Welcome to the Daily Challenge for September 22nd, 2014. Let's begin. Yeah. <laughs> 
Man, holy crap, what a run. I don't think I've ever actually gotten this far before in a daily run, have I? Not in terms of score, but just in terms of actual level progression. Man, I was so rusty with these enemies when I got to these, I was like, it's been forever since I've encountered these. I almost didn't even know how to fight them. That was, that was a crazy run, there's a lot to talk about. Let's see how my score was. Number 24, yeah, there's a lot of high scores there, because there was a lot of... There was just a lot of stuff. <laughs> there was so much stuff. Oh my god. Yeah, that was pretty insane. Oh my god, I lost my coin multiplier so many times. Whew. Yeah, so I think the uh, most interesting early decision I made was to buy that... Uh, buy the crossbow. I really wanted to try it some more, and it's not the titanium crossbow, so it's not nearly as good, but... Considering what I had was a dagger. Upgrading to a crossbow, even if it does do less damage, the, uh, the range of it made it totally worth it, in my opinion, and I just wanted more experience with it. It just seemed like fun. Unfortunately, though, pretty soon after that, I got the obsidian spear, which... You know, deciding between the obsidian spear and... The crossbow is really hard, because the Obsidian Spear has good range and really good damage. The crossbow only does one point of damage, which is a major limit, but it does have insane range, so... It's, it was kind of close, but I think the spear is just better, thanks to the damage. Which is why I went with that. So I kind of regret buying it, only because I found something later, but, you know, I couldn't have known that I actually was going to find something good later. And then when I touch the Shrine of Risk, one thing I did not account for, that I've now realized, is that once you touch it, all the items surround you. Which means you have either two decisions. Either you have to make the decision of what item you want within one beat if you don't want to lose your coin multiplier, or you have to just stay there and lose your multiplier. I really didn't want to lose my multiplier, so I kind of just panicked and basically hit a random key. I didn't even know what I was picking up, but that's when I picked up the, uh... The, uh, what the hell was it? Oh, I think it was the Obsidian... Broadsword? Or... I don't even remember now, but I picked up... something. Just because I panicked. So that's definitely something to consider. I'm probably just gonna have to eat the coin multiplier. I think it's better to, to lose it and actually, you know, choose wisely from your... three items than it is to take a random item. Yeah, I probably should have just waited. Let's see, what else happened? Hmm. I'm not sure, just a bunch of... strange things 
I was kind of overwhelmed facing enemies that I'm I, I, that I haven't gotten to very often during daily daily challenges. So I kept kind of freaking out over them, trying to remember how the hell to fight them. And once again, I kept getting hit by the Shrine of Risk on every new level because I kept forgetting to move on the first beat. Although this time, when I came to this very last level here where I just died, I actually did remember to move, which avoided me from taking the damage. However, I kind of just mashed the movement keys, so I actually lost my, my coin multiplier. But I did move on the first beat, so at least I avoided the damage. Yeah, that was a... I would describe that as a fun clusterfuck. That was a mess. There was tons of items, lots of stuff to choose from, lots of things to touch. And I ended up getting to an area that I haven't been to in a very long time. I'm very rusty with this area. Very rusty. I'm actually amazed I survived that first onslaught during this level. There were so many enemies around me. But I guess I just kept my coin multiplier up enough that everything died within one or two hits. But yep, the fucking goblin got me. Those damn goblins. They're tricky. They're really tricky. Alright, well that was a very exciting run. That was pretty crazy. That's one of the craziest daily challenges I think I've ever done. So, that is it for the daily challenge for the 22nd of September, 2014. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.